give them a couple little things. This is a, a little booklet, and as you can see, it says, Welcome Home, Chris Windling, and it's got some pictures in it. And in the back, <coughs> there's some uh, there's a thread off of our website. People all over the country have stopped by our website to uh, wish Chris a uh, welcome home and thank him for what he's done for us. You can go on the website and check it out. I'm sure there's some more there. <coughs> this is really exciting. Chris is kind of an American Idol. You know, I, so one of the things I sent out said this is a combination of American Idol and uh, Extreme Home Makeover, although I don't see the bus out there. <laughs> the reason Chris is our American Idol is because while a lot of us are sitting in our, in our lounge chairs watching our flat screen TVs and drinking our beers, which I'm sure he does when he's home. You're, you're too young. <laughs> Come on, I saw you hiding that Schlitz. <laughs> he has made a decision to step up in front of those things that he loves the most. His friends, his family, his country. And go out and do something that very few of us would want to do. And that's protect our freedoms in very remote and terrible places. It's his birthday. <laughs> and also... It's Chris's birthday too. Aww. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. I'm gonna give each of these guys here and that one over there in a uniform that's got some device and he keeps pointing it over here. <laughs> these are our Warriors Watch mission beads. And they remind us when we're out there riding who we have to thank and why we're out there riding. And I'm gonna explain that to everybody here, including the guys in these helmets. I'm not sure about these guys, because I know that I've seen them on TV when the building's burning, they're running into it. My mother told me to do the opposite, but for what they do, I thank them. The blue beads at the top are for the Blue Star families, like Chris's family, who endure endless hours at home while their loved ones are deployed somewhere, protecting our freedoms. The black beads are for the MIAs, the POWs, and all the veterans, and we want every single one of those people out there that are unaccounted for, we want them home. The yellow beads at the bottom are from the Gold Star families, and those are families that have made the ultimate sacrifice. And all of these sacrifices, and all these things that these people have done, whether they were held in prison camps in Vietnam, or whether they were missing in World War II, or somehow they were missing today, they've made that sacrifice on our behalf. And uh, the red, white, and blue, of course, in the middle, that's for what we're all fighting for. Thank everybody for coming out and having me. It's a lot of fun. Kind of overwhelming, so. <laughs> Totally different. Yeah. Or how, what's the before and after like here? <laughs> wow. It's nice. Yeah, I'll be able to enjoy it for my next. I think I took 30 days a week, so we'll hang out down here. Right? Hang out in the home theater yeah. area. Yeah. We'll hang out down here. Thank you very much, guys. Welcome. What was this like before you left? <laughs> storage. Yeah, it was storage. It was my storage for all my military stuff. So it was just bare military and hunting stuff, but now it's it's pretty great. Yeah. 
so it was completely unfinished yeah, it was, to finish? Yeah, it was completely unfinished. Yeah, un well, I wouldn't have let my kids come down here alone, I don't think. <laughs> <laughs> And so, now you probably can't get rid yeah, of them. You'll all yeah. be downstairs. Yeah, let them come down here. Yeah. What's so. What are your thoughts? I mean, obviously a lot of people hammering away and putting things to yeah. up at TVs and everything else. I know they've been working a long time on it, and it's greatly appreciated. Because we would have never done this. We would have never done this. So it's a good place for my kids to come and play and come and relax. What is it about him that makes you so special? Um, he's very dedicated. Um, if you say he lives by the own values, that's absolutely true. Um, and definitely cares a lot of us. Obviously moved by all of this. I mean, just what is it that you'd like to share with others who don't know all of you, who don't know him and the sacrifice, tremendous sacrifice that he's made? Um, that, you know, to him it seems like nothing. And, I mean, to us it is what it is, you know. I mean, we just kind of support him and do what we can to support what, um, where his heart leads. And, and um, you know, for him, I guess, you know, just supporting all the military in the way that we try to support him is probably the best. And the support that you've received in that project like this? Oh my gosh, overwhelming. <laughs> <laughs> this was just amazing. I, I, you know, I my girlfriend asked me to do this because she thought it would be a good idea, and I said, what's the chances? So when it actually came through, I was just really shocked, really shocked. And what do you think of the final result? It's amazing. <laughs> Very amazing.